Hello, hello, it's your girl Danitria. And I woke up super hungry. And I haven't done my hair yet, but I'm gonna cook and then I'm gonna get dressed. So tune in. So I'm gonna do. So I'll tell you some mushrooms. I already have them like sauteing a little bit, little mushrooms, little garlic, a little bit of kale to go in my eggs. And I'm going to brown a little bit more. Add a little bit more garlic. I just made some coffee. And I'm a big fan of brown everything. No white eggs, no white flour, no white sugar, brown, everything. So we got the pan good and hot. We're going to do three brown eggs. And I save the shells for my compost. Turn that down a little bit because it is cooking, baby. What I want to do is I'm going to make me an egg sandwich with some avocado. So I'm also going to toast some bread. I don't keep nothing plugged up. Everything gets unplugged until it's time to use it. We're not pulling any extra electricity, baby. So, we're going to hit them with some Himalayan and some black pepper. I'm a big fan of pepper. And I'm also going to add a little bit of Parmesan, just a little, and then a little bit, slap your mama, just a little bit. I'm going to let that cook a little bit, and then I'm going to toast my bread. I got some pineapples. That I'm gonna have on the side. And I'm also gonna make me some coffee. It says it's not ever good to do coffee on an empty stomach. And so I won't um brown bread, hence the brown bread. So I won't uh, just sit and drink coffee all morning. I'll go ahead and start my breakfast. While I'm having my coffee, and that way, I'm good to go. And I actually had a little bit of kale and bok choy and spinach already cleaned from my salad. So I was just adding a little bit of that on the top. I also keep the stems. I keep all the stems. And I finally cut them up and put them in my salad. Because if you know anything about vegetables, the nutrients are in the stems. And a lot of times we throw away a lot of the goodness of the vegetables. This is good stuff. If you are big on smoothies and juicing, you can juice these. Um, but I definitely cut them up and use them. So we're going to grab... And the only thing I don't like about wood is that I don't have a good, I don't have a wood spatula. Like, sometimes I just want to fry my eggs and I end up scrambling them because I want to use this wood. So I'm going to try to flip it. I actually done pretty good with the wood spatula. Coffee cup. I love this size because it fits so much coffee in it. <laughs> now, do I need so much? I really don't, but it's amazing. 
So I do a non-dairy creamer, which some days I'm feeling a little cinnamon toast crunch. Some days I'm feeling a little caramel. Some days, ooh, I want to catch a fire. No. Some days I'm feeling a little French vanilla, so I just keep them on hand because I'm big on coffee. And I really, really, really want it to taste the way I want it to taste or I'm not going to be able to drink it. So. Actually, use my coffee spoon for garlic. Definitely don't want garlic in our coffee. Man, I put garlic in a lot of stuff, but we will not be doing that in our coffee. And like I said, brown everything. Let's add us some brown sugar. And I do like it a little sweet, so I add. A little more sugar than the norm, but I works it out. So as long as I'm working it out, <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> so I do like my egg a little, uh, my yolk a little runny. I think the fact that this garlic is so quick to stick. So I'm going to turn it off and let it simmer while I cut my avocado. And I thank you for joining me for breakfast. Next time you should drop some comments on what you would like to see me cook. Now I didn't say I'm going to cook it, but you can drop a comment and I'll let you know. <laughs> Very good, very good. So we're gonna get an avocado ready for this sandwich. And I like to keep my leafy greens in metal and I top it with glass because for me, it seems to last longer in the refrigerator. So when I buy my um, any of my greens for my, my salads, my bok choy, my spinach, my um, lettuce, <laughs> I put it in here. I clean it and go ahead and put it in here. And I have it in the refrigerator that way I can just dip in and make me a quick salad. I dip in and use it for my sandwiches, for my eggs, for everything else, and it makes it a lot more convenient, but it lasts. Like, it's still, like, crisp, and I can promise you it's been in that bowl for a week. But that's why that's all I have left is still, is because I've been on it, on it, on it. So. Because the avocado is so wet... I like to um, have my bread really toasted. That way, when I um, spread the avocado on there, it doesn't wet my bread. So what do you like in your coffee? I know a friend of mine who uses hot chocolate um, or the chocolate, Hershey's chocolate that you can pour in. Um, some people put whipped cream. There's so many options with coffee. I think that's what I like about it is every day I can kind of do something different and it's really fun. The shirt just... I guess I'm going to have to start ironing my pajamas because my collar don't want to stay right. I'm out of the stages of pop lock and stuff. Like, I don't need my collar popped and locked. <laughs> so, we're going to unplug those because we're done with those. Put these eggs up. Later, I'm going to put some chicken in the chicken, I mean, in the air fryer. <laughs> so maybe you could join me. 
And I'll show you how I like to make my broccoli and a few other things I like to cook with my chicken. So thank you for tuning in. I'm about to enjoy this lovely breakfast. And I hope you have a good one. Take you some time to enjoy your view, whatever your view may be. There's so much beauty out there to see. Love you, love you. Have a good one.